Um, so intimate partner violence is a pattern of manipulation, fear, and coercive control that happens within an intimate relationship. It constitutes using a variety of abusive behaviors, and that can be physical violence, sexual violence, psychological aggression, emotional abuse, stalking or surveillance behaviors, and economic abuse. The abusive behaviors occur over time, not all at once, um, and they're also interspersed with very normal times, times without violence, times with love and happiness, and it's this interpositioning of the violence with the love and the abuse, with the love and the care, that makes it very difficult for a victim to extricate herself from that situation and from that relationship. And what would you say is the overarching dynamic of these relationships? So the overarching dynamic is the um, abuse of power and control of one person wanting to have dominance in that relationship, say over most things that the couple or that the uh, victim does or does not do. Please tell the jury what coercive control means. So coercive control is a tactic of victimization. Um, the goal of it is to uh, establish dominance. What coercive co control does is that it imposes negative consequences for noncompliance with your partner's expectations or demands. And what that does is it erodes away at the victim's autonomy and her independence. What is psychological aggression? So psychological aggression is threats and the imposition of threats with the intent to control someone's behavior. So it's doing, it's doing a threat so that you will modify your behavior and do what your partner wants. Um, some psychological aggression techniques are intimidation, um, slamming your hand on a, on a table, punching a wall, throwing something, mumbling under your mouth, cursing, screaming, sort of these, these high emotional balance type of activities that can cause a victim to feel afraid and feel intimidated. And then if there has been um, an act of physical violence where that contingency has already been established that this person, your partner, has said, okay, I will not only have the ability to use violence against you, I also have the willingness to do it, the intimidating tactics take on greater flavor. They take on greater salience. They mean more because you know what could be coming down the pike. 